last question for you. The movie explores the concept of dreams. And I mean, I'm telling you, I was bawling like a baby throughout this one, but also how our dreams change. And I'm just wondering, you know, for you, you wrote this, you started writing this when you were 19. So like, I'm curious how your dreams have changed from that kid to then workshopping this, you know, at the drama bookshop and then, and then to now. Yeah. Well, I, I think it's, easiest to define that by character. I think when I started writing this, I was closest to Nina. I was at a college where I was one of a few Latino kids. I was experiencing that culture shock with other like-minded first-generation Puerto Ricans and Dominicans and Mexicans and and, and everything uh, at Wesleyan. And now when I watch the movie, I'm Kevin. I'm closest to Kevin. I have two children. I would do anything for them to do whatever they want with their lives. Um, and um, it's going by so fast. Um, and so, you know, for them, In the Heights is a new show. <laughs> you know, they grew up with like, yeah, daddy's the star on Hamilton. Um, and now they watching them fall in love with the show, the show that their parents fell in love while I was writing. Um, it's it's, um, you know, the, the dream like now the dream is all of these stars, all of these young stars like Leslie and Melissa and Corey uh, and Anthony, like watching them create their own lanes in this business. I'm so excited to see their next chapters. Yeah, it's I can't wait to be walking around the city and hear the kids singing these songs. That's what I always love.